What's up guys, Boy Davis here, back with my part 2 of the Dragon Mask tutorial. Um, we're just going to be grabbing the last three that we missed before. Um, they were all incredibly hard to pronounce and I'm going to do my best to avoid pronouncing them. Um, the first one is part of the main quest line. So of course we have to take a dragon to get there, because that's the only way you get around in Skyrim these days. If you're not cool, you have to walk. Um, yeah, so assuming that you're watching this to get all the answers, um, here's the puzzles. Um, we have the three birds to open the, that door over there, which is a chest. Then the change one in the middle, and to the snake and then hit it again and you have your door to continue on. The next puzzle is whale from left to right. Whale, snake and then bird. Um, just hit the button and the little drawbridge comes down. Nice and easy. Um, the claw for this is on the... Um, he was a death guard for me. Um, in the right next to the door so that makes it pretty easy. So then just like you've seen a hundred times before. Uh, read off the um, combination, flick it all around, put the key in, and we're off. Um, as I said, this guy's only accessible during the main quest, although you can't really miss him. He's pretty important, and you know, you have to kill him to get to the next stage, so good luck missing him. Um, he started off on like half health for me for some reason. I hadn't actually attacked him at this stage. Um, watch out for his ice um, spikes, they hurt a lot and they slow you, so um, if you can either pop some um, potions to negate that, or just dodge them really. Um, this guy was a bit of an idiot, he decided that he went to get really really close to the edge, and then when, as I came up he decided he didn't want to face me, so he jumped off and committed suicide. Which is quite nice for me because I didn't have to do any extra damage to him. Um, and just walked over and picked up his loot. Um, his mask gives you plus 50 magicka. Destruction and restoration spells cost 20% less. Okay, we're next going to Fornholst. For. Fawn. Fornholst? Maybe? In any case, it's you on there on the map. And you get this guy, he's like, he gives you a quest to go get the staff of um, whatever, dragon priest staff. Um, this is to the journal, um, this little path here. You don't really need the journal, um, went the wrong way. Um, it's a matter of getting a key and if you can pick master locks, just pick this lock. If not, you have to go the long way, kill a whole bunch more dudes and um, get that key. Um, here's a little glitch where everything was up in the air. That's a bit weird. Um, to ruin it for you, they're um, killing little children, so you know they're bad. Um, when you come up to this, make sure you stop here, turn right, and there's the key. It will actually open the gate for you. So, same thing again, combination, door goes down, fight is on. Um, this guy has a whole bunch of um, undead helping him and he summons suits so um I think I'd die this first time um, there we go um so the way I did it was I switched it up I used my ice form shout which freezes enemies um cause you can hear all of the um shouts from the undead dudes going off in the background um basically I lined them all up shouted once got most of them um, and then that took him out of the fight, which was quite handy. There we go. Look at that. Um, then just took out this one go, and then it's just a matter of taking out the um, Dragon Priest. Um, there are other ways, but I found that was the best way. Um, watch out for his staff. Just try and keep moving like I do, um, so he doesn't have a chance to trap you in a um, wall of flames because that will kill you quite quickly. So there we go, down he goes, and then just finish off these um, draugas and we're good to go. Um, his mask gives you increased stamina, 
uh, 70 points, which is quite a bit. It's quite useful, and his staff's really good if you're into using subs. I never have been. Um, here's his word. Um, it's well, um, the final word in, well, depending on which words you've got. It's one of the words in Lightning Storm. Um, uh, the next one is in Volthum. This is actually, I think, the first one you're supposed to get Leave because it explains stranger. quite a bit. Evil um, this guy this wants help to kill him. Uh, when you come to this room, um, I was quite stupid. <laughs> Looked around a lot. There's actually just a switch on the wall there to open that door. Um, easy as. Um, so that's what you're looking for. Three of them. Um, this chest, booby trap. Just watch that. Um, yeah, I spent a lot of time in this room. I couldn't really work out where to go because I, I was looking for like a secret. Um, little secret there. If you hit that, giant spider pops down. Um, not really helpful, but there's just a chain next to the door. I spent a good 10 minutes looking for some fancy way to open it. Um, watch out for those. I don't know how really to get past them. I just ran in the end. Yeah! Snuck <laughs> and then ran. This took the damage and healed after. Um, there's the key to this door. Watch out for the fires. Uh, yeah, we all know how to do these by now. There we go. Um, yeah, um, you just have to grab. There's no, it's not really that much of a challenge. It's just a whole bunch of drawers. Um, there's a, another quest here that you pick up out of this chest. I haven't done it. I didn't really feel the need. Looks a bit boring, really. Um, anyway, there it is. Um, if you're ever looking for that quest. Um, a new hand touches my fraps decided to die here and um, destroy my frame rate. You have to go back past these. If you see in the corner there, that's where the third one is. Um, yeah, my fraps didn't get it, and this is a bit of a laggy fight because, again, fraps just not agreeing with me. Um, the way I beat this guy is I put an enchantment on my sword that drains um, his magicka, so I can get in there. Um, his magicka was already pretty much gone. I just had to watch the lightning walls, um, and that, that was pretty simple. Um, his mask is almost useless. It gives you immunity to disease and poison. A bit boring. Um, we then go back to Labyrinthian. Um, and there's a little hut just inside of the gates here. Um, looks innocent enough. If you walk around on the inside, there's a skeleton and he's got a wooden mask next to him. Um, just pick up the wooden mask. Make sure you have all of your dragon masks on you. Put on the wooden mask and you get teleported back in time. Um, you then just pop the um, masks, all the chests are empty by the way, there's no really points on them. Um, just pop all the masks in there, they go they go by themselves. Um, just pop them all there and then the mouth opens up and you get your super secret um, fun mask. Which, um, when the wearer is on low health, um, there is a chance that the mask will knock back enemies, heal the wearer and nearby allies, and grant a fire cloak for a brief time. Also, on very rare occasions, it'll summon a spectral dragon priest to come help you, um, which is really helpful. Um, I'd chuck him on one of your companions because they go down every 10 seconds. Um, here's me just owning. That'll be the end of this video. Um, Thanks for watching, um, rate, comment, subscribe, and if you have any questions, just post it below. Thanks guys.